I honestly thought it would be less than that because there's no toiletries in there. They're all in this one. So that's a little embarrassing. Houston, got some coffee from Starbucks. Also got a breakfast sandwich, which I already ate. The girls got some Chick-fil-A. Girls wave to the camera. Aw, thanks for waving, y'all. That's so sweet. Kind of slept on the plane, not really. It's one of those situations where it's like, I think I fell asleep, but then I'm actually not quite sure if I did. So like, I, I basically didn't. It didn't count. And I'm running on about two hours of sleep. As soon as I got some shut-eye, finally. Time to put your tray table up. Oh, okay. <laughs> The song is probably not even getting picked up on audio. <laughs> it's finally by CC Pennison. Oh shit, sorry. Okay, okay. These are our two rooms. These are our Which two one rooms. do you want, Sarah? Okay. Okay, so there's one. Are they adjoining? Yeah. They are doing conjoining rooms. Was it? I need to be on the side of the bed with the night so I can put my earplugs in and my eye mask and everything kind of consolidated next to me. She's really easygoing, probably. <laughs> This is our gorgeous little, what would we call this? Welcome, welcome box. Welcome, welcome box. Guests. Okay. This is our welcome box from Patty and Maddie. I can't wait to open. Thank God we got conjoining rooms. I think we, I know. What would we do if not? We're hamburger heavy. We have a free meal. Oh, we gotta go. We got two cookies. cookies. Ooh, pickle chips. Soft Ooh. Yum. Liquid IV. Yeah. I actually okay. brought my own. Um, That's so I'll good. Y'all have these. Okay. <laughs> yeah, we got Advil. I also brought some Advil of my own. Hi, Chews, y'all. We got high Chews. Two little baby water bottles. Cute. Oh, we. Oh, <laughs> oh it has the little matter. crest. <laughs> You, that is the third water bottle you dropped today. Is there like a little luggage thing in there or are you using it? Um, no there is, you can have it. Sick dude, where is it? Multiple on one hanger. Okay, I have two mini and two midi options. I'm kind of nervous about these because I'm like, I don't even know if they're like really in season. Yeah, I don't think that's very in season. Okay, perfect. So that one's out. That's more in season. A little bit more, but still that's like cute. tropical. Oh, um, yeah. So you would say this over this. At least we know yeah, that. Yeah. Okay. This is definitely in season. I love that one and I think you should wear it at some point. Okay. Well, I could wear it tonight. I thought you had another mini. I do. I'm going to show you. Okay. But so do you like this over that mini so far? I can't, I have, I can't decide. I need to see the other okay. one. Okay. This is gonna be the skirt top situation. I don't know what it's gonna be like sitting in this eating Italian. Oh, uh, well, even Actually, just seeing this one, I'm voting the midi out. The do you tropical. like this more? Yeah. Yeah. The, you and like the, the tropical. Okay, so trop mini. Tropical's out. Okay, so Farm one Rio of the midi. is not today. Farm, Farm Rio, not today. I love oh. that. Do you like this more than the brown, or you're I just kinda, of, you don't know. Okay, let me go poll the girls. So Sarah's been able to narrow this down to two. I am, however, gonna show you all four. Okay. We have two. Oh. Don't tell us which ones. Right, no, we have two mini dresses and we have two midi dresses. Mini, right, girls? midi. Yes. Got it. Yes. Okay. Are you wearing like a little nightgown? Yeah, it doesn't look it's like a hospital so gown. Cute. No, I love it. No, thanks. I feel like it looks like I'm in the ER. This one, okay. maybe out of season a little. Mm -hmm. That's, okay. yeah, that's giving more summer to me. Okay. This one, also another Farm Rio. Farm maybe, Rio, Farm Rio, Farm Rio. Maybe a little that's... bit more in season. Well, I like Rio. that. Okay, so this one over the orange. Yes. Yeah, which is what Sarah said. Sleeves halfway down the arm, and then this thing like ties like a little weird. Okay, thing. I like that. Kind of show a little side uh -huh, stomach. Yeah. Midi, we have this, which is very in season, very fall. 
Oh, that's really Ooh, cute. that's yeah. Borge. Where's that from? Oh, is that from I forget Zara? the name of the brand. Wait, it's um, Zara. it's not Zara. It's a weird website. This Taylor Swift was seen wearing this in New York, and I immediately wow. Okay, I think you should wear that. Okay, then I have one more. Okay, well Taylor wore that, so. So this is kind of a shirt dress combo, but the way it lays, it looks like it's one. I'm piece. already liking that. Oh, okay, so I this is a skirt. More. Oh, it's what? Can you turn this? I'm oh. gonna dry in time. Yeah, I'm sure. You're giving, that's giving like princess to me. Of course it, but it like lays over it so it looks like one piece. I kind of like that. I, I think like either brown. one of the long ones. The brown is definitely going to be comfier to like eat in and dance in and exist. Yeah. So like maybe do that. But this makes me look like snatched. Okay. If you're going to be snatched yeah, tomorrow, maybe you don't tomorrow. need to be snatched tonight. Right. Like. Tomorrow is giving a little bit also kind of Victorian era. Also, I need to try sitting in this corset to kind of see that, how that, that feels. Yeah. Option one. This one. I can't decide. I think I can sit in this at dinner. This is what I'm wearing. I'm going with brown and black, brown, black, gold. Kind of breaking fashion rules, but there's something about brown and black that I like. This is definitely more comfortable than the other option. We're going to eat at a place called V now. Just our whole friend group. We're meeting up for dinner and then we're gonna go to the event all together. In the back with how short my dress is. I can get in the back. Sorry, I just gotta leave. I usually will always get in the back, but I'm just a little worried. I got it. Yes. Hi. I'm Chad D and I'm super nervous. I filmed for Channing. If anyone has seen Channing's vlogs, this is kind of the mastermind behind those. It's me, not her. So I can hire you as my camera. You can hire me for ten dollars. So. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah, you're doing it, it for Channing for free, aren't you? Exactly. I'll be in LA in, in a month. We are going to do so so much together. I'm excited. It's gonna be so fun. Hi all, oh, Sally Dar's vlog here. We're doing a takeover. <laughs> Hi, we've got Sarah and we've got Patrick. Chad D has his camera. And Sally Dar was saying, oh my god, Chad D has his camera out and it's making me miss my camera. Well, guess what? We have a camera right here in our pocket. Megan Cam. Megan Cam. Oh. Hi all. Hi all. Cal and Brooke and Patrick. Hi all. And Maddie Bug. Bye all. Shannon, you have to stand. He's giving me the mic real quick. She's getting mic'd up, hold on. I just wanted to say I really appreciate everybody gathering here on my behalf this evening. We have not one, not two, not three, but 17 people here. <laughs> right now. I'm looking forward to not only what the night entails, but et cetera, as well as also to in those involved in and also adjacent to. Woo! Yes! Woo! Cheers, Cheers, Cheers to the cake! So I'm realizing I did not even explain the schedule of things. So while we were at this dinner was when the rehearsal dinner was happening. And then after the rehearsal dinner, there was a post toast, which is where everyone was invited. So that's where we went after this dinner. So this was the night before the wedding. For this video, I just vlogged before and after all official wedding events because it's not my wedding and I wouldn't want someone doing that at my wedding. And also we were just all living in the moment and celebrating something in real time. There is no sense in vlogging all of that. Hope that is okay. I'm gonna talk to you now. I'm serious. It's bad. <laughs> it's about you know who. They did the thing. What? Are you fucked up? <laughs> I fucking love it. Let's go. Come on. What are you drinking? Come on. I'm doing a water bottle. Let's go. That's a water? Yeah. Oh, that's off brand. <laughs> Putting myself to bed after a long night. A long night of kind of dancing in heels. You're so brave. My yeah, brave and girl. I was really tall out there. What? I'm sorry, I was just gonna come in and say goodnight. Y'all, I have to What do you want? Get out, I need to go to bed to tonight. Y'all, Sidar, get back in your room. No, don't you can't put out with me. People are gonna become annoying. <laughs> no, I'm not. I just need to go to bed, y'all. It's late, I'm tired. I'm feeling drained. Can you smile with no. your um? Hey, I need Oh, you look so cute with your little hair. Oh, oh, Let the record show that we were talking to them for about like an hour. Yeah. And then all of a sudden they just. That's Frankie. I really do love our room. Sorry. Oh, I think it's like the most gorgeous room, so and cozy. it's gorgeous. It's do the you most. Want to shut those blinds or no? Yes. Okay. I'm gonna go ahead and do that. Don't worry. Hold on, Hannah <laughs> P. Where is my phone? No, 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 no. It's here. Hold on. Hold on. They've got it locked down in there. 
No, did I leave it in that? No, they're gonna hate me. Uh -oh. Hey, y'all. Lead with grace and apologies. Is my phone in there at all? No. Are you sure? I don't see it. Okay, I love it, y'all. Let me kind of take a moment. Oh, got found it. Found it. Got my phone. Water. Water. Okay, yes. Oh, wait, I don't have any underwear. <laughs> Okay, I'm not getting that. Oh, you don't have undies on either? <laughs> okay, let me take my hair down. I feel like that like makes me look a little bit like more like, stunning and gorgeous, etc. You already are. Thank you, Annabee. This is gonna go ahead and be my bed piece. Nighttime routine before going to a friend's wedding. Yes. Okay. Oh, I cut your head off. Oh, that's okay, Hannah B. Don't fucking worry. Nighttime routine before going to a friend's, but like plural apostrophe. Plural apostrophe wedding. Because they're both friends and it's uh, <gasps> Hey y'all, how are you? Good morning. I was at the bar and then I was downstairs in the smoking section of the hotel. <laughs> Why do they have a smoking section? <laughs> they just like kind of have a smoking section. By the end of this weekend, here's the issue is like, oh, I would do that too. Okay, I actually wish you would. Okay. <laughs> I need to, have to figure out a we were just about to do a nighttime routine. Tell them what this is from. Oh, you're, you made a Coca-Cola mistake. Yeah, a big one. A big <laughs> one. A big <laughs> Okay. Like, where we at? Like, 1 a.m.? At the local, the local hub? The local venue? The local hub. The local much. watering hole? So I am running about two to three hours of sleep. So, like, it's actually scary that I'm, like, not just, like, being, like, you're I really need, like, you know, like, what's, like, what's up? Connor got kicked out of the bar. What Why? Why? Because he got too freaky. They said he got too freaky, and I will be putting that in the vlog. I was kicked oh, out. Connor was completely was, kicked out of, of the venue. I was escorted out of the venue that night. <laughs> what was the reason that the, the, the bouncer gave you? The bouncer was able to communicate to me that I was being too freaky. <laughs> it wasn't good. And he got too... The back of his shirt was filthy. Disgusting. Ew, because he kept... With sweat? Or what? He kept bending he over his, backwards. He took his jacket wrapped it around his waist. It's like a nice jacket. Did the security guard come up and say, you gotta go, you're too freaky? Yes. I kind of looked at his back, just like sweat and wet and just like dirt well, stains on his nice white shirt. Like leaning back, he must have hit the ground. He oh, God bless him. God bless him. What um, a good man. Was, okay, <laughs> but this is my Jonas Brothers blouse from their most recent concert. Five really? Album, five oh. albums, one night. So this is kind of a picture from each of their five albums. Aww, they look and so then cool. this, is every single song they sang on the tour. Can you turn around a little more? Mm -hmm. Thank you. Oh God, I'm so tired. I have a wedding in tomorrow. Not my wedding, I just have a general wedding. So Wait, I need to do that so again. Cute. Oh my God, I'm so tired. I have to go to a picnic in the morning with all of my friends at 11 a.m. <sighs> okay. Good night, all. Good night, all. <laughs> Good morning, all. We're getting Matt and Patricia. We are getting. We are. We're getting. Yes. We're getting Bunt Cake and Matt Bug married today. Liquid IV kind of took two Advil, as well as my gummy vitamins and my daily prebiotic. And now we're going to a picnic. What brand do you use for your daily prebiotics, Eleanor? I use Ritual as well as Seed. <laughs> Those are the two. Yeah, so That's kind of pick your poison. Ritual, seed. We're going to a picnic put on by Channing, Channing's family, etc. Fresco, we're having a fresco picnic. This is so pretty. <gasps> we made it to Rhodes Park. It's looking stunning. Aww, hey. Good morning, Alexa. Good morning, aw. How are Good morning, aw. Come over here, come on, zoom in. I'll walk you through the spread of Please. grazers. We have cinnamon rolls. <laughs> we have some fruit and some nuts and some blueberry muffins, blueberry. as well as some croissants over here. I so love it. This is the spread. I hope you enjoy it. <laughs> oh, good morning, Pat. Gonna act up. <laughs> uh, so I dry heaved once okay. and then I puked once. Okay. So okay. one and a half. Oh, okay, perfect. Okay. Well, personally, I would like to know highlights and lowlights from the past 24 hours and who contributed to the lowlights. Highlights probably dinner and mocktails with the girls last night. Okay. As well as dinner and dancing with the girls last night. And don't hold back on the name. Okay, in the highlight zone, I would say Chad, oh I would God. say Taylor, <laughs> I would Mr. say Dubois. Maddie, I would say <laughs> Goldie, and I also would say Max. In, in terms of my lowlights, I would say my lowlights actually gonna go ahead and be Francesca and me. 
get into a fight last night. <laughs> about <laughs> not what? Oh, I was with night. Francesca did not want me to play my music and she did not want me to sing. <laughs> it was 1.45, lights were out and I was it doesn't The lights were not out, the lamps were on and I just felt like I did not want to go to sleep with that energy, but I did and then that's why I woke up with a puppy face and a swollen eye. So. You think it's from me? Who are you currently having a crush on and why? Like celebrity wise, I feel like y'all know. Lauren. Who last yeah. night were, do you think, like of the eligible bachelors, like if you had to pick one? <laughs> <laughs> What's your goal for this weekend? Totally. My goal is to have a good time. Well, that's a good goal. Maybe a little more specific. My goal okay. is to have a good time with my friends. Oh, yeah. that that's good. Do you imagine yourself flirting with any man tonight? I usually do like to find a target at a wedding, <laughs> as you all might know okay. or may not know. But I don't know if there will be one here tonight. Kind of the sign piece that they put up for us. Welcome Redacted to the Fresco Picnic. Doing shirt giveaways with Miss Alexianica. Hi y'all, I'm Alexa and I work at the Beverly Hills branch of Fresco Picnic Co. Oh, I love that. <laughs> Stunning. I earned it. Is Brooke okay? Mm -hmm. Go get sharp. <laughs> Much better. <laughs> oh. Sorry. Oh, that's gorgeous. Where did make it zero? I think you refer to him now as. <laughs> <laughs> some energy before we have to get ready for the night. I need to take a nap. <laughs> you look so tired. Or did you guys not eat anything? Publix. We ordered kava. It's on the way. Oh. Publix. Publix. <laughs> So the man at Publix actually gave us a deal because he rung it up as one sandwich, which is cheaper than getting two halves. Oh, so wow. So really did us a solid. However, we did wait for about 20 minutes because they were moving at a snail's pace. There was no sense of urgency. How much are those sandwiches at Publix? Um, the way he rung it up, about like $9 and some change. Separately, it would have been like $6 and some change. That's going to go ahead and be Sarah's. We both got Italian. Sarah got white bread with lettuce. Can I see it? And mayonnaise in the pop sauce. That's oh, kinda, gorgeous. That's okay. Sarah's. Now let me show you mine. All right. It's going to kind of be on some multi-grain due to the fact that I did ask for white bread. Gorgeous. And he, um, he was did not, able to put it on multi-grain. He did not hear me. And uh, it was just like we had waited so long at that point mm -hmm. that I was like, it, it is what it is. Completely. So banana peppers. is the Gorgeous. I love that. I'm a bread. big banana pepper girl. One bite. I dropped mine on the floor and the girl mm. six times. Let's go. Attempted to steam my dress. Really so difficult. I'm just giving up at this point. And then I was trying to steam the straps and I got them completely soaked. So hopefully that dries. But you know, TBD. I just realized the side angle of my face in this footage is awful. <laughs> Hannah P is looking stunning in this little bow dress. You look gorgeous. Thank you. Can you kind of show everyone what's going on in the back? We do kind of have a safety pin going on, okay? That's okay, her hair kind of covers it. So stunning, Hannah P. Thanks, guys. Hey, Frankie. Hi. We are just wearing an old dress from Zara as well as shoes from ASOS. So. Mm -hmm. The shoes are stunning. Thank you. These are like my classic going out wedding dub party mm -hmm. shoes. Yeah, kind of kind of the go-to. Yes, they're like falling apart. So. <laughs> Hi, all. I'm in my dress and I'm really scared. There's just like loose pieces mm -hmm. and like ties and whatever. A lot of moving parts. I think, honestly, I just need to have a cocktail to yes. stop. Mm -hmm. Well, it. everyone needs to kind of see the earrings. I kind of the match the match the bag. Kind of ties into the red tones you Where see here. Hand tote's tote actually from Amazon.com. <laughs> I love that. I love it. And I just needed an evening hand tote for this event. Yeah. Don't think I would be wearing a maroon handbag very Just often. in general. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So that's why I felt comfortable proceeding with Amazon.com. Yes. And I agree. And then I've also got this gorgeous, stunning little shawl piece. Mm -hmm. For the church. Amazon.com because I am kind of doing open back. Uh huh. Okay, so I am. I'm afraid of man upstairs and um, <laughs> I don't want to get in trouble and I do not want to upset any of the old people so that's why I went ahead and brought this bad boy. <laughs> oh hey y'all. Head to toe of my outfit piece is going to be ASOS. Wow. Head to toe. Oh yeah. ASOS 
ASOS. This is going to be from Amazon. Oh, okay. So you, not true. That's not a I so. said for outfit piece. Oh, okay. That's sorry. part of the outfit. Can you kind of give us a, a little bit of a spin? No. I'm loving how the dress is kind of asymmetrical. Kind of, kind of this, this thing. Like we got this flappy. Uh-huh. That flap knot on that side. Yeah. Which that does kind of, it, my boobs do pop out of this dress. Perfect. Every time that I move. So kind of a shoulders back evening. Okay. Where is your dress from, Emma Bug? Hey, my dress is from All Saints via Bloomingdale's and I had 45 minutes to get it. Mm-hmm. But I do really like it. It's so pretty. It's very I Emma. Lean down because okay. I'll flash my boobs. Um, shoes are Urban Outfitters. Stunning. Bow is really Urban bows. Outfitters. Oh wow! And this is Cole Gaia. Okay. Well, in my last vlog, everyone kind of already saw this whole get up, but this is from Louise, New York. Shoes. I love are it. I love ASOS. it. Bag is in there. It's fine. Don't worry about it. Earrings. These are from Target, and they're my my, my most complimented earrings. That's, and I love that's them. Amazing. I can't believe I snagged them. And then this piece. It's from eBay. I love that. Kind of a dangly let me let me breath. zoom in. Let me get a little. She's gorgeous. I love oh, it, Darbug. My just everyday earrings to to these. Yes. Oh. Oh. <laughs> so we're doing I conflicting love those opinions. Earrings. I like both of them. Um, I present like, from me. You have. Oh, actually, you have some. I think I like the crosses. Oh, we have different. Okay, where are the crosses? I would just keep those in. We're yeah. Not going to church, so. Yeah, right. it'll kind okay. of keep you holy okay. in there. All right, let's go, y'all. We are on our way. We gotta get some good pictures in front of the church, so we're going a little bit early. Aww. Back from the wedding it is far too late. My mother is picking me up in a matter of hours, so I gotta go to bed. Well, actually, my feet don't hurt as much as I thought they would. I feel like my feet hurt more last night than they do tonight. It was so fun. I can't believe they're married. Gotta wake up to see my mother in the mornings in about six hours. I'm in Tennessee. Sorry, my room just got painted, so there's like painter's tape everywhere. I'm back from Alabama. The wedding was lovely. It was so fun. If you want to see photos, I would just go on everyone's Instagrams. It was so fun. It was so beautiful. I did cry several times. The most I cried was Patricia and her dad dancing and her dad's speech, like could not take it. It was just so wild. Like that is our first married friend couple in LA. Like that's the first LA marriage in our friend group. And that's just like, wow. And congrats to them. It was like literally such, such a wonderful weekend. And I'm so happy for them. Now I'm back in Chattanooga. And as I mentioned in the last vlog, I do think I need my maid of honor dress hemmed. So I tried it on for my mom this morning and it has to be hemmed like this much. It's literally so annoying. Like it is, I swear to God, it might be like a quarter inch. It's probably like half an inch. I'm going to go to the alterations place so we can kind of get her to start working on that. Um, because I do need that dress in about a week and a half. It's dinner time and I already made myself a pimento cheese and turkey sandwich, but I was like, I need a Coke and we don't have any Coke in this home. And so I'm going to McDonald's and I'm getting myself a little Diet Coke and my dad wants two Big Macs for dinner. So that's what I'm going to get. And I am driving my father's car, which I have never kind of driven. So this is gonna be either fun or a learning curve or a little bit of both. It is really confusing. Like when you hit the gas, it like automatically breaks for you. It doesn't like roll at all. Any car that you drive that's not your own is weird to get used to, but this is like not, not the typical car vibe. It's just like crazy. It like really breaks for you, which I, I did not know that Tesla's did this. Or maybe this is just an electrical car thing. I have no clue. Could I get a large Diet Coke? And then could I also get two Big Macs? And that's all. Thank you. Five, six, and seven. Thank you so Have much. You too. 
I love when drive throughs sorry, this camera angle is so bad, but like, I don't, you know, it's not my car. I can't put my camera where I normally put my camera in this car. I love when drive throughs have two windows, like one that you pay at and one where you get the food. You know, I, I want two. I want the experience of paying and then moving up. Just feels, it feels like you're moving quicker through the system, even though you might not be. There's no reason why my thigh should be included in this shot, but it's what we have at the moment. Thank you so much. Hell yes. Oh my god, it's so close to the camera, it's throwing the focus off. It's like nectar of the gods. They just told me to pull up, like, past the window. I never understood when fast food restaurants do that. There's a crystal here that always does that. It's like a white castle. It's like a southern white castle. If you've never heard of crystal, it started in Chattanooga. And the crystal here always does that. Like, they always tell you, like, oh, can you just go park and we'll come find you? I don't understand. The car in front of me, they asked them to pull up. And now they're asking me to pull up. So they're going to ask the car behind me to pull up, too. Like, I just don't get it. Like, at this point, shouldn't you just, like, wait? She's coming, she's coming, she's coming. Thank you so much, you two. I didn't even think about asking for ketchup. Shit, should I have asked for ketchup? Fuck. Let me call my dad.